So the first change, uh, change we have worked on is uh, whenever the user is looking for um, a plugin that doesn't exist, for example, he can now see like an empty results message and he can click on uh, clear filters to revert to the initial state. And then he can uh, look for another plugin. Uh, this change was um, done by Victor. Uh, shout out to Victor. Um, and also, if you're looking for a plugin that actually does exist, you can also use the clear filters to uh, revert back to your initial state. And um, another change uh, we have worked on was um, showing um, the part of set information in the plugin page. So um, before, you can only see here uh, like the maintainer of the plugin. And now we have added another additional information, which is the part of set information, which tells you uh, this plugin, if, if this plugin belongs to any set. Instead of having uh, this information uh, down there, that section, um, uh, the set section will still be there for any maintainer of the plugin or an administration. So they can manage um, these sets. But for the normal user or the anonymous user, uh, the information is now above, so it's more clear for, for them. Um, the next change was uh, in the plugin uh, preview um, model. Uh, so whenever you click on a plugin, you can see this uh, pop-up. Um, let me just look for a plugin that has more information. For example, this Poodle filter, uh, you can now see uh, who's the maintainer of the plugin and uh, which set uh, the plugin is part of. And we have also added uh, some of the awards that the plugin has. Um, we just name uh, some of them. So these were the changes on the model uh, preview card. Um, another change that was uh, received from uh, the feedback of the user, uh, which was uh, the spacing in this navigation block. Before you could see that um, all these links were like pushed uh, to the right a little bit. So now it's easier for them to view uh, the plugin types without having um, a lot of uh, empty space. Um, yeah, I think um, these are all the changes we've done this sprint and we will continue um, to enhance the user experience more on the plugins directory page. Thank you.